all right guys here we go again i uh, went back for another uh, sd card uh, we're gonna do round two um i know you guys sensed that it was uh there was genuine fear in my voice when i was going into these caves uh there's been deaths that have occurred here um and this is the type of danger that i like uh you know the danger that's human created no thanks you know that's just irrational and dumb and senseless but this type of fear adventure um i think this is healthy you know when you can overcome your fears um we don't have a flashlight it's getting dark pretty soon it's already getting super cold um this is all i have so i'm gonna get back in there the, the phone died on me when i was uh, last time i was there but um let's see how deep i can go it's mostly fear of the unknown what it is you know um i just spoke to someone that was up there she said that they used to have this blocked off and nobody comes in here unless they have a hired um uh, someone that, that there's an expert at doing this so what i'm gonna do hopefully they can capture it is uh i'm gonna light my path like this at least you guys can see like look at this look at the beautiful rock formation right here this is what i'm gonna do so i have no light i'm gonna try to go as slow as possible see how deep i can go the fear that i have is mostly you know, my biggest fear, to be honest, is that a rush of water will come here and just flood all this up. I don't know if it happens once a year, once a month, once per day. Um, I don't know. That's my biggest fear. To some, like, crazy animal coming out. Oh, that's it. Um, and then, of course, the fear of something collapsing on you you know these rocks Ooh, look, at this. look at that beautiful green i mean these rocks there's rocks on the floor for a reason right uh that means they have to fall in from somewhere so that's a genuine fear right there that i have and the other one is that if i if there's like a a hole sinkhole or something that i can fall into Oh my god, look at these caves though. Jeez. Ah, oh, it's so cold in here. Exploring the death caves of South Wales. Look at this, look, look at the height. Oh. I don't even have a flashlight. I don't even know what's up, what up ahead. Oh my God. Oh, ooh, this is nice. I'm able to stand now. All right. Beautiful rock formation. Look at this. Feels rough too. Feels rough. I'm afraid a bear or a saber toothed tiger is going to come out of here and be like, oh, talking about rough, huh? Want to feel rough, eh? Nah, no, just joking. Not afraid of that. These, oh my god, these caves go deep. They go deep, deep. Look at, look at how low it gets. How low can you go? How low can you go? Oh, and it goes deep. Gosh, this is so scary. Whew. I'm doing the do, though. Most definitely doing the do. Like I said, my biggest fear is a big old rush of water will come here. And uh, I'm basically a goner. And you, and you hear the water. You hear, what do you do? What do you do if a big rush comes? Oh no, oh no. What do we do? Besides run, before you know it, you're consumed by a bunch of water. What are you gonna do? It's 
Y busco un día de esa I'm winging it. I had no idea these caves were here, for one, right? But I saw a sign that said death may occur or something to that extent. Injuries have occurred, death has occurred, things like that. And I said, all right, let's go see what the danger is all about. And here, oh, here you really, really start to hear uh, the water now. Shut up so you can hear. You guys hear that? The danger level seems to be rising and it's definitely getting colder in here. Holy crap. Can you guys see all this? Well, look at them. This is all water now, guys. Can you see it? It's getting pretty deep. I don't know how to swim. So, I'm gonna head back. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I would have gone deeper if I had a flashlight, but I'd be a liar if I told you that I didn't, that I wasn't scared. The fear of the unknown was definitely present. So many hikers up there were saying, oh, don't go in, don't go down there unless you have a hired professional who's done it before. And they couldn't explain why I can't explain why, Jesus, I shouldn't come here. They just said people have died and people have gotten injured. Oh yeah, I checked it out. See what else I can find it. Let's go up here. It's a little drier over here. Let's see what we got over here. If anything, look at this beautiful rock from me, you guys. Look at this. This right here is worth it for me. You know? Being so deep in there um, would have been pretty much more of this. However, here I feel that I have a better chance of surviving. This daylight right there. I have to run and a big old tidal wave comes crashing through here. Look at the rock on top. All right, I'm gonna head back out that way, and um, I'm gonna take you guys on a on a hike. You know, so hopefully you guys stay tuned for that. Um, I think you guys might like it. This is a beautiful place, Four Waterfalls, South Wales. Um, it's in Brecon Beacon, must visit place. If you guys plan on visiting Wales, you have to come here. Mark my words, man. You guys will love it. Definitely an adventure's paradise.